Hello and welcome back, Josh, Sam, and anyone else who's watching to Lviv and Let Die. Now, nothing has happened except it took me about 20 minutes to skip through a few days because I also went to the toilet. Um, now, we're going to play Olympic Donetsk. I'm not going to mess around and waste your time, guys. I'm going to be right in with it. Um, also, to note, we have our Seska game coming up soon, so I am not going to start Rosic. Uh, in fact, are we even going to... No, he's going to be on the bench. We can't probably do without him playing at all. Um, we will give our starts to a couple of other players. I think we'll probably, for example, play to a Marcy instead of Unison. Um, maybe we should have done this the other way around. Kurt is not going to play, and nor is Rogers, but that's it. So that's the team that's going to play in this one. Should be good enough to beat Olympic Donetsk. Uh, they're playing with five across the middle and only one up top that's a bit of a shame uh, means that we'll probably struggle to break them down a little bit uh, although you never know they are pretty rubbish we might be able to just rip through them we don't have our one good striker our one really good striker but we do have plen insec who has already shown himself to be good and pretty incisive so hopefully he can get another goal here today herbert puts the ball out kamara herbert takes a shot a rare shot, but curls it over the bar in the first minute. Uh, we've got to remember that uh, Krivbas are playing against Odessa today at home, so it's unlikely we're going to see any points dropped by them today. Odessa have only scored, I think, 16 goals all season. Oh, no, they scored 31 goals. Oh, completely wrong. Uh, but they have conceded a bunch. Um, there we go. There was a free kick there from them that we saved, just about. Um, and they are, they are winning already. Krivbas, yep, fucking typical. They, they've scored in something like 23 or 24 games in a row. So they're, uh, you know, keeping them out is unlikely for most of these teams. And considering that I think Odessa has con conceded the most goals in the league, along with the bottom club, it's uh, unlikely that they're going to hold out for some points in this game. Uh, but never mind. It doesn't matter. This isn't the game that we expect to win anything, any uh, points back from. We do have to do our bit, though. Uh, Olympic Donetsk have not always been 2 0 now. I've always been the most um, welcoming of, of teams against us. They they did, I know they got relegated a couple of years ago, um, but in the run of seasons up before their relegation, they seemed to draw or beat us in almost every game they played. Uh, we, we struggled for a while uh, to beat them. Um, Aliyev, the only man up front for them, curls the ball around the post. So yeah, the hope is we can win this game. 31 minutes gone though. You would think that we need to make a few more challenges on their goal than we currently are. Sarayin. Maybe we should have played Borovkov to give him some fitness because he's not playing. Um, and I just remembered that he has to play. I forgot we can't play Plen Insec in the Champions League. Oh, well, never mind. Plen Insec going around his man, but uh, Pavlov gets back there with his dog to tackle uh, Tumasi now throws the ball in. Panda go to doesn't do anything. Gonzalez goes around a man. Vera now tackled by Masivicius. Machivicius. Not a sure. Not a sure. Anyway, Tumasi now do not shoot. Oh, you fool. Not cool at all. 41 minutes gone and we're not doing well. I'm not happy with this at all. So I will be telling the lads that. Telling them as much. Far from pleased. Calmly then remind them that they are good. Okay, we have probably 15 minutes and then I will start to make some changes, as is my want. Um, Jurich now finally gets on the ball. Pleninsek now is running there. Can he give the ball over to Dimba, perhaps? Cross the ball back, cut the ball back. Planinsek back to Jurich. Jurich has a shot, which is a rare, rare event. Uh, it does sail over the bar, unfortunately. 53 minutes gone now. 56 minutes gone. It's moving forward. Jurich. Herbert. Planinsek turns. Oh, Ivanov manages to make a very good save. Dimba hasn't really done anything, so we're going to take him off. Uh, we're also looking at Pandagoti with another injury. And we'll bring on Carvacho. Make those uh, changes. Kamara reads the game well. Has a shot. Uh, but there's a reason that he's a right back. So we've made our three subs. Uh, hopefully this will be enough to get us a goal in this game. Did I underestimate Olympic Donetsk? Yes. Um, 
was I right to? Yes, I think we should be able to beat these with our second string, but whatever. Cavacho, Cavacho hits the ball over after good work chasing down from Rosic. Um, at least we are making chances. Still, surely took it out. 70 minutes, what the hell's happening? See, this is what I mean. This, oh, this is so fucking annoying. And I bet they've absolutely battered the bottom team. Yeah, 3-0. Oh, Donko scores! <sighs> Donko scores his first league goal for the club. They claim it was offside. I thought it was myself, to be honest. Um, but it looks like we managed, to, we managed to nick a goal. Let's go back to standard. What happened there then? Tomasi, Rosic, Plenincek, and then, okay, so that wasn't offside at all. I just glanced up. I happened to be not quite looking. I uh, just glanced up and saw that he was not offside. Good. A 1-0 win over Olympic Donetsk is just about enough. That's all we can really, I mean, considering the way that the first 80 minutes went, that's all we can really request and require from our team. Would have liked more, but it's okay. Rosic, Rosic scores. <laughs> of course he does. Donkor is it that's lovely stuff and we are now two nil up so what looked like a possible dropping of points has now uh, turned back into three points for us Krivbas have unfortunately won three nil against Odessa or you know at least they've won against Odessa so that's a shame um, but two late goals for us is all that was needed we have managed to get the points in the end I suppose we can be happy with that uh, we did restrict them to a fairly few chances. They actually had more possession than us, which is slightly weird. Uh, but never mind, Donkor came on and uh, got himself a goal on an assist. So that's nice to see. Okay. Um, labelled the biggest match of us. It's stupid. Uh, certainly made it hard for ourselves. We got there in the end. Juric has also played in 100 games for the club. Kofi was excellent. He's been very good in his first few appearances. Um, he'll be starting, I think, against Seska because Pandagotu is, for some reason, ineffectual and very injury-prone. Um, that game seemed to last, like, three minutes. I mean, how long have we been recording? Seven minutes. We've already played and finished the first game. That's impressive. Uh, anyway, we have now time to turn to what I was expecting to be the harder of the two games. Um, Olympic Donetsk have already made the first game more difficult than it needed to be. So... We can only hope that Seska are feeling a little bit more generous. Now then, the boys from the military come to Lviv to play against FC Lviv, only found in 2006. Um, a brand new team, relatively speaking, even though that is now uh, 63 years ago. In game. <laughs> 63 years. That's crazy, but it's true. Uh, Seska, Moscow... They, uh, if, in, in case you haven't already watched it recently, uh, they beat us 5-3 in the previous game at Moscow. And so we have three away goals, uh, meaning that a 2-0 win would be enough to send us through. Um, if, I mean, it would still I was going to say a low scoring, but actually would still have to be relatively high scoring. Um, two goal at win would put us through um, as well. Although I think if they, yeah, and it would have to get to 5-3 again before we went to extra time. So basically we just need to beat them. Um, there are many, many um, potential variations. Um, well, there's not that many actually. Um, but uh, there are many potential um, score lines that we can we can achieve. But basically 2-0 or a win of two goals will do it for us unless we get to the extremely unlikely 5-3. Um, and then if it was to go further past that... <laughs> Uh, they would go through on away goals, but I, I mean, it's not going to happen. So stop talking about it then. Well, I would, but I uh, just seem to not be able to control what comes out of my mouth at the moment. Nevertheless, we have had two very strong results in between our Ceska games, so hopefully we can translate that into a uh, win today and uh, go as far as we've ever been in... Um, the Champions League, I think we've got a bit further. I think we'd get to the semi-final or to the quarter-final of the Europa League a couple of years ago. Um, this would be the furthest in the Champions League we've ever been. We're currently at the furthest we've ever been in the Champions League uh, because it's the first time we've ever been in the knockout stages. 
Let's see. Galashkov uh, doesn't enjoy our uh, style of football. Uh, interesting. Oh, they lost their game in between. They've lost two games, in fact. And they're now down second. Uh, it's interesting and something which has a bit more incentive. Um, I'm going to say that. Every team that reaches the stage has a chance to come out on top. I have to wait and see. Okay, let's see their form. So they've actually lost their last two games, uh, Tesco, because they were top of the league before. Uh, let's have a look. Squad fixtures. Yeah, so they lost 1-0 at home to Rostov and then 2-0 against Spartak. Where are Rostov and Spartak? Rostov down there and Spartak. So they've obviously taken their eye off the league. So uh, Zenit, you can thank us later. Um, but it does mean, that, yeah, and they're in bad form. So that does keep pushing us forward. Russia was another league that I was considering um, taking over a club in. But I think straight after Lviv will be no good because it's another tough to sp speak um, foreign land. Um, I think we'd like to go to somewhere a bit more uh, Western uh, with easier names and teams that people have actually heard of. <laughs> uh, but yeah. So they're slipping up. They're slipping up. This is good for us. This, is good. this can only be good for us. Come on. You can load. It's only three days. Here we go. Right. What's happening? Dusseldorf. What? No. If someone like Shakhtar wants them, then he's not going to them. Sorry, Imanol, you're staying with us. Okay, here we go then. Lviv versus Tsesko Moscow. Um, our game, the more interesting one of the two, because Spurs won their first leg 4-0 away at uh, Bayern. So that doesn't seem to be a game that has much resting on it. But this game does have something resting on it. And that thing is excitement. Uh, right, so we can now restore Jimmy Rogers to the first team. We can restore Musa Kurt to the first team. And if we look in the midfield there, we do have Tordi Jonsson on the wing. We're not going to play Ronnie Vera. We are going to play... Where is he? Where did he go? Why is he not there? Why can't I see? Oh, Alexis Kovacha. Henrad goes there. And then Bakul comes here, I suppose. Right, and that's the team. No, it's not that the team that's going to take on the challenge of beating Tesco Moscow. Doncourt has been in good form. He's getting the reward for that. Two games, for, or three games for the club. He's played very well in all of them. Um, our goalkeeper hasn't conceded for a while. They're in awful form. They're playing a very different team as well. Are they even playing the same? Oh, I didn't get to see what they're... Oh, I didn't bother looking. That was stupid. Can I not see that? Yeah, preview. Ah, okay. So they're playing Boltham up front. He's a mid. Did they do that in the last one? Yes, I think they did. Kazayev is playing instead of Ivo. He's not that good. Sharkov was there. Henriksen was there as well last time. Yes, he was. Galliano is there. He's new. He's a winger, apparently. He's 35. Terrible. Won the league a load of times with them, though. And uh, they're actually playing Spiegels. He also that good one. Yeah. So, the, no, it's not that much changed. Anyway, let's go. Here we go. Unfortunately, we have to play Borovkov. I don't know if you, uh, like I said, I'm not sure when you watch these two videos. Musukert! Uh, uh, they'll be uploaded at a similar time, but you might not watch them immediately after each other. Uh, Borovkov has to play because we sold Kulibali um, uh, because he was running out of his contract. So I wanted to make some money from him. And it was after the point where we had to submit our team for the Champions League group stages, uh, later stages, sorry, Borovka has a chance there. And so I didn't get a chance to actually register someone to replace Koulibaly. So we're stuck with just Borovkov and uh, Rosic up front. <laughs> Other options. Rogers, good tackle. Bolton, Henriksen, Galliano, big ball back to the winger, but we head it down into the arms of the goalkeeper. Paredes again takes it well. Seven minutes gone. They're trying to bombard our box. Um, but now Rosic has been let through. Spiegel. Oh, Belhadi. Good save from Belhadi. Uh, Rosic come running through. Manages to get away from Spiegel, but doesn't quite get the ball in the box. Henriksen clears. 
Rogers looks like he's going to get it. Uh, Kozaev has fouled him. Are we going to have a free kick? No. Trebelsi was injured in our last game, but manages to shake off that to come back into the team here. Kozaev hits the ball wide. Not a very good striker. Not as good as Baltham, anyway. And we are now 10 minutes gone. Oh, nobody challenging. Why? Baltham, Baltham. Oh, hits his ball ah, just over the bar there. We've had the better chance, according to this. One half chance, but they are coming into it a bit more. Big Mick heads down. Borovkov now. Borovkov could just slip through Rosic. He does. Rosic, he's on the ball. He goes around. Oh, he tried to give number 24 Spiegel a... The, the 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 slip but he didn't Donkor puts the ball in the middle Musa Kurt has got his first goal for the club in the reverse fixture Musa Kurt Herbert Musa Kurt again getting a lot of touches on the ball Rosic goes around his man puts the ball in the middle uh, Belhadi takes it and Borovkov was way late in coming in for that and now they kick the ball and we do manage to win it back strange decision to kick out to the uh, left wing from right side of the box but whatever Henrad Donkor Donkor puts the ball in Jornesson wins the ball but they manage to take the loose ball and take the ball from us um, say take the ball more Juric Kasayev scores he's not even good so we need to win 3-1 at this point <sighs> Lviv kick off oh, and they have a free kick straight away Rogers, Donkor, Donkor oh better ball than that and we could have been through oh it was Borovkov though <laughs> uh, he did score in the last game can't argue with that Rogers, uh, Juric didn't I'm uh, sorry Rosic didn't Juric didn't either Rogers to Henra, Donkor come on now Come on, the Donko to Rosic. Rosic floating out to the right to get on the ball, I suppose, to get away from Spiegel. Uh, Henra to Herbert. Rogers. Henra. Donko. Donko back to Rogers. Rogers to Henra. Come on. Nicely worked. Bit of calm play. Three of them standing right against the edge of the box. Juric has the ball. Henra went for a shot, was deflected. Musakut wins the ball back, though, and we have it again. Juric. Turns, but oh, he does manage to keep the ball. We've got it. Oh, Gustavinho clears and it's a corner. Gustavinho, their naturalized Russian left back, uh, he's actually Brazilian. Uh, Donkor now. Donkor puts the ball in the middle. Musa Kurt wins it, but heads over the bar. 23 minutes gone. There's been a lot of chances in this game, uh, lots of highlights. It's going to be a long one. Donkor back again. Donkor has the ball, puts it in the middle, comes off of Borovkov's arse. Uh, Donko puts the ball to Juric Juric to Rogers. Henra goes round one tries to put the ball in the middle does oh and we've won ourselves a corner from some slightly dodgy defending there um, nice tenacity big George and Mick oh heads it down Belhadi taps it back out in to the six yard box and Musa Kurt was just foiled the ball comes in again Rosic has the ball Donko puts the ball in the middle Musa Kurt no Rogers. And now they manage to clear their lines. Uh, Beltham clearing for them. Juric has the ball, though. Paredes, big kick. Uh, Kofi Donka gets a foul. He's going to get a yellow card for that, he thinks. Oh, no, he doesn't. He doesn't get booked. Okay, Donkor puts the ball in the middle. We do have another chance from a corner. Donkor again in the middle. Herbert puts the ball back to Jonasson. Jonasson scores. Lovely thought from Herbert there. Torda Jonasson. Jonasson turns and... Puts the ball into the bottom corner. Belhadi, unable to keep it out, does get a hand to it. Lovely turn there from Herbert. Jonsson hits it low. Belhadi lets it in and it's 1-1-4-6 on aggregate. There's a lot of football to be played. Still 55 minutes. Gustavinho now out to Baltimore. In the last game, every time we scored, we then conceded immediately. Um, we actually took the lead in that 5-3 loss, uh, which is frustrating. Uh, but it's okay. This time we haven't conceded immediately. Maybe we'll score again. Jonasson ambitiously goes for it again. He had Rosic there and he had Borovkov with whom he could have played the ball, but he didn't. Uh, Trebelsi. Trebelsi tries to get across in. Jonasson blocks the first attempt, gives it to Baltham. Uh, Jurastov and Jonasson now. Oh, come on. Trebelsi pulls him back. I mean, that. Cynical, cynical. Trebelsi now. Sharkov, Henriksen to Baltham. They've made a bit of space for themselves with Sharkov. 
Shark was running across the box. Oh, Kurt gives away a foul. He's going to get yellow carded. No, he didn't. Okay. Every time. I actually just say things in a moany voice and it doesn't happen. Henriksen's going to score, though. Oh, and he does. Oh, Ola Henderson. Henriksen, sorry. Ola Henriksen. In off the post. Paredes. Okay, so we're two one down. It's seven to four on aggregate. We would need to win four two. <laughs> uh, I'm far from pleased, maybe. Okay, so we've got forty five minutes in which to make a stunning comeback. And the first chance goes to them. Onra, Borovkov. If only we had a different striker instead of Borovkov as our only other option. So annoying. Uh, Galliano, Baltham, Yurastov, Gustavinho, Baltham hits the ball over the bar. Where are we? What are we doing? Badly. No one's doing particularly badly. These two are not playing great. Eddie Chang is going to come on for Rogers. We need Rosic to get a fucking goal. Musa Kirk clears. Jonasson doesn't get there. Yurastov plays it out to Gustavinho. He's not the best player. We put him under pressure and he plays it back to their goalkeeper. That's nice. Put him under pressure a bit more. Baltham. Baltham goes round his man, comes back in. Henriksen hits the side netting. The first three minutes of the half, they've had a lot of chances already. Chang on for Jimmy Rogers now. Henriksen puts the ball in the middle. Oh, Pequeno. Guignon heads the ball over from their corner. That's another chance for them in this half. Jonasson, Borovkov, Rosic to Donkor. Donkor takes the shot, but it was blocked by Gustavinho. We now have a throw on the right. 56 minutes gone, 57 minutes gone. We've got a corner. Donkor puts it in. Henriksen clears. Rosic is now with the ball. Inside their half. Chang out to Donko. Donko puts the ball back in the middle. Rosic scores. Donko puts it in. Rosic scores. And it is 2-2 two, two on the night. 7-5 on aggregate. <laughs> um, we need to get two more goals to win this game. Could it happen? Could the absolutely unthinkable happen? Gustavino to Galliano. Yurastov. Henrard tackles. Borovkov, Borovkov's through, Borovkov, Borovkov, oh, Borovkov's is saved, he was through on goal, if only he was a better striker, that could have been the moment that we turned this game around, Donkor puts the ball in the middle, Musa Kurt, oh, Juric shoots from long range, it's two shots in two games from him, oh, it's getting tense now, 63 minutes gone, 66 minutes gone, another corner, Donkor puts the ball in, why did you not head it, Borovkov, Chasing Henriksen down as he makes his way into our half. Galeano. Galeano has a shot, but it's gone over the bar. Now then, what can we do here? Gogua on for Henra. No, Henra's playing okay. Borovkov's not doing very well, but we can't really. There's no one to bring on. Tuomasi for Jonsson, because Jonsson's 76. Okay. Tuomasi comes on. That's the change that we're going to make. Paredes. Henra. Uh, okay, Paredes had it again. Is he going to do another long kick? He is. Another long kick. Borovkov meets it, collects it, and tackled by the centre-back. <laughs> great stuff. No, it's great. He missed it. It's fine. We haven't even had a chance to take our, free, our uh, player off yet. Come on. Okay, here comes Jonasson off for Tuomasi. They've made a couple of... Oh, they've brought on I Ivo as well. They're, they're concerned. They've brought on an attacker. The ball comes in. Pequeno clears. Musa Kirk gets taken out completely by Bolton there. Chang, though, wins the ball. That's going to be offside. He's not. Rosic. Oh. Enra. Enra hits the ball over the bar. Seventy-four minutes. Enra. Borovkov. Oh. Enra again. What 
What do we do? What do we do? Maybe Gogwa. That's our third substitution. We haven't got any more. But I can't take off Borovka. I, I just feel that if we didn't have if we had someone better than Borovka on the pitch. 76 minutes gone. Gogua with the free kick to the back post. Rosic has scored. It's 3-2. It's 3-2. Rosic has scored. Gogua comes on and sets up the goal. Come on. We've got 12 minutes left to win this game on on uh, ag on um, away goals. Come on. Gogua swings the ball into the back post. Rosic heads us into the lead. 3-2 against Seska Moscow. One more goal puts us through. Yurastov. Yurastov gives it to Gustavinia. Veresh now must have come on in the meantime. Henriksen to Ivo. Ivo turns and hits the crossbar. Chang. Chang with the ball. Puts the ball up to Borovkov. Borovkov doesn't quite get there, but Rosic keeps challenging. Spiegel has put the ball out because Pekinion. Pekinion has been injured. They are playing 4-5-1 four, five, uh, four, five, now. Uh, five minutes to go. Six minutes. Four minutes to go. Overload. Just, just go for it. Henriksen puts the ball in the middle. Oh! Oh, God. Oh, that's gutting. Ironically, if we did score the two goals that we need, it would now go to extra time, <laughs> which I said there was never ch no chance of ever happening. Oh, if only Borovkov had scored that effort earlier on. Oh, man. Oh, no, Ivo's going to score. Don't lose it. Oh. <sighs> Henriksen crosses. Tuomasi gives it to Henrard. Oh, Henrard, take a touch. Ah, oh, that's very frustrating. Are we going to get a chance? Are we going to get one last chance? Shubin. Ushakov. Shubin. Ushakov. Henriksen to Baltham. Are they going to score now? No. 8-6. <laughs> Ah, uh, we did so well. We did so well. Ah, uh, that's so annoying. Rosic scored two. We're out of the Champions League, guys. Um, we might still have the top scorer in the Champions League. You never know. Um, but oh man, we had more possession. We had more chances on target, at least. Bayern did beat Spurs. Oh, that's so close. We can be proud of that performance. £2.6 million, pounds, not bad. Um, it's the fifth time in the history we've lost on Avagri. We are in form, though. Goals galore. Oh, that's so annoying. <sighs> and they had a penalty given to them in the first game that shouldn't have been. So, so we played really well. Yeah, Pequeno, he's rubbish as well. He's not played well at all season. Yeah, well, we did well. We tried our best. Okay, so what are we going to do? That's a good question. Uh, the Kruvbas game is key, so why don't we play Kruvbas and Karpathia? I think it makes sense. Uh, the two games before it are not particularly, uh, not super exciting, and Karpathia is a derby, so that will be a good video. We'll see what we can do about clawing back the league. Um we also still got the cup, which we have an interest in, but we'll we'll see what happens with that. Anyway, guys, uh, sorry for the loss, uh, but we'll see you in the next one. Bye.